hey guys assalamu alaikum welcome back to my channel uh, i hope everyone of you is keeping well and safe so in today's video guys we are cleaning strictly cleaning <laughs> there is no cooking yeah so uh, on this day i was actually cleaning my kitchen trying to clean some of the places in my, in my kitchen thoroughly and i also was cleaning the shower but unfortunately in this video i couldn't show everything and the reason for that really is that later on when i was finishing up nicely my kitchen uh, like scraping the floor and doing all the other extra things that i didn't show in this video by that time we had lot shedding so my house have very bad lighting so yeah i couldn't show that part it was just yeah the, the video was not gonna be good if I, I did show that part yeah so yeah i hope you get motivated and clean along with me or yeah just get motivated to do your next job in your house thank you so much for being here thank you so much for uh new subscribers guys we are growing as much as we are growing slow but we are growing i appreciate a lot of you guys we have joined this family and i hope uh we're gonna grow slowly slowly up until we reach <laughs> the goal yeah and uh to all my returning subscribers thank you so much guys for your support thank you so much like thank you thank you thank you Thank you, may God bless you for all your kindness and for all the love that you guys show me. I really appreciate you. So guys on this particular day i didn't have bicarbonate of soda that i would usually mix it with my vinegar and uh, this decreaser i do use it if i want to clean like your hard surfaces where it's really really dirty uh, but on this day i could do without it it's just that i didn't have the bicarbonate of soda uh, this chemical is quite too strong so i don't like to use it every day and um, but i did mention on my last video where i get it uh it's written decreaser it's a yellow decreaser uh so yeah you get it from those people who sell uh cleaning things privately they sell like everything your pine gel like they sell everything handy handy it's just that it's not branded so i just usually just support them by buying uh pine gel and only this decreaser the rest i usually don't like it uh, because i don't feel like it's as strong as like your handy handy the one we know <laughs> content basically is a homemaker i love to organize i love to cook uh, i love to do diys and i love to take care of my kids too uh in years i've kind of like perfected to do kelly hair so i like to share that sometimes with you guys 
and yeah many more things about me in the future that we will get to show each other and teach each other yeah so i hope if it's your first time um and you love it here i will appreciate if you can subscribe and come and watch more content and give this video a like thank you so much for being here you are so welcome to this family so another thing i forget that i like to share guys i share anything that is in my mind with you guys and i hope you guys don't mind as i take you guys as my friends so obviously we share with friends right so i just share and i talk and i talk and i talk i hope you guys enjoy my talking and you know what i love to get positive uh, criticism if you come to my channel and you see something that is not right they say usually people they would say it's not what you say it's how you say it yeah so yeah so i'll appreciate just anything must be positive uh, this is not a negative uh, channel we are not here to give any negative vibes we are here guys to give motivation to other ladies as me myself have gotten motivation from other ladies it's just like that it's a circle you understand you get motivation from someone you give motivation to someone the world is just big enough for all of us to be to shine to understand and give and learn from other people i've learned from other people i give motivation and maybe you learn something from me that's how it goes Take it slow, where you go, I go to. And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you. Let's take it slow. Who cares where we gotta be? You know. So on my previous video where I did my kitchen makeover, I know some of you are maybe wondering why I'm still keeping this old stove. Uh, my other stove is a gas stove and this one is an electric stove, right? The two plates are still working. So whenever my gas is finished, I know I can just use it quickly because I don't have an electric stove like a two plate or to use it uh, for emergency once uh, my gas is finished. So that's why I'm still keeping it. And also for the oven, this is an electric oven while the other one is a gas oven. So I'm just keeping it for that. Uh, hopefully, uh, if God willingly, when I do, uh, uh, do a renovation of my kitchen, I will still buy an electric stove because you know what i need to have both of it as you guys know uh, i love to cook so i need to have 
both of things just yeah but yeah that's the reason i'm still keeping it it's actually uh, finishing up space in my kitchen but just because i don't have a two plate and it's a good stuff actually it's a you know all things guys are very good so yeah that's why i'm keeping it uh, otherwise uh, and another thing the really reason that i'm really keeping it inside my kitchen is that it's attached to the wall uh, it, the connection is not like a plug you know if you know your old stoves the electric the electrical stoves the old olden days ones they are attached to the wall so that's why i can't take it out otherwise i should have taken out and i should have put it in my garage and then whenever i need to use it i can always go use it in my garage but yeah it's just a big job to do that yeah i will only just move it once whenever when i have uh, millions to change my kitchen <laughs> If you are still here watching thank you so much thank you so much i really appreciate it so i started already here with the shower i was trying to thoroughly clean it uh usually i do clean it once a week thorough uh meaning like go with a toothbrush in between the tiles to avoid the mold from growing as i hate the mold i hate when the tiles are black in between uh, so I do do that once a week and the other days I just you know slightly clean it just so that it looks clean but otherwise once a week we do a thorough cleaning of my shower. <music> Days 
Guys, I bought this racket, Mr. Price. I thought it was a stainless steel. Uh, obviously, it's not because it has rusted so much. And I only bought this, I think, a year ago. And uh, I tried to spray paint it two months ago. And again, um, yeah, it didn't help. Yeah, maybe um, I have to go buy another one. Maybe it's some hardware shop. Maybe that will help. I don't know. But yeah, but I'm just letting you guys know that it's not as dirty as it looks it's just the rust it's coming out and if you are thinking of buying one at mr price this will happen but maybe it's because i use it inside my shower so the water is always passing on it if you use it maybe in your bathroom like in near your bathtub where it doesn't get water maybe it doesn't get rust i don't know i'm just saying you know slow, where you go i go to and if you hit the bottom i'm going down with you let's take it slow who cares where we gotta be you know you'll have a good time where i can go let's take it Okay, guys at this point i was finished already cleaning my shower i did the glasses i did the tiles inside and i did almost everything there uh, but the problem is the space is too small to bring my ring lights inside um not ring lights like my stand to put my camera to show you guys everything nicely it's just too small so i did whatever i can do i show you what i could show you yeah but i hope uh, you were motivated guys and yeah i'm finished now and uh, please don't forget to give this video a like if it was something that you love watching and uh please don't forget to subscribe if this was your first time coming on this channel thank you so much again thank you so much for everyone for stopping by and please take care guys love you all bye bye